Hi, my name is Ralph Beach and I'm 44 and I currently live in Ladson, South Carolina. And a brief bio is um, I have brown hair, hazel eyes, uh, I'm 260 to 70 pounds. Uh, I have a twin brother, his name is Roy Beach, and uh, seriously I have one, and I have a picture of him. And uh, what classifies me as a nerd or a geek is that I, love, I have a love computers and I'm in the medieval. Uh, I'm not exactly a jock, you know, because I have a heart condition, but, you know, it doesn't stop me from doing what I do. It's just a little bit different from everybody else. But I'd rather get into computers and watch sci-fi and do medieval stuff and I have an amp guard I do you know it's pretty cool you know and I believe I'm fairly intelligent you know I, I'm a fast learner and uh, my favorite thing is designing things and uh, coming up with ideas for things you know that nobody's have thought of and I've got a few um, I'm very good. I'm very good with mechanical, you know, using my hands. Uh, I went to school. My, I went to. I got my. I had to get my GED, but I studied for about two and a half weeks, and I passed the GED the first time. And it was all five tests at one time, so that's a pretty good accomplishment for me. I'm not super smart with math. But everything else, you know, I'm pretty good at. You know, I've just never really been into math. Because, you know, I know you need it in life, but it wasn't really a big subject for me. You know, I was more into hands-on things. Uh, I went to college, and I got, I went for a computer network technician. And I have a GPA of 3.64. Could have been higher, you know, but that's another story. Um... I got certification for Windows 98, 2000, XP, Home and Pro. Uh, I'm still working on some more and I also have certification with Microsoft uh, Excel and that's it's been a while since I've used Excel so I have to get back into it. Um, I was just, in college I was the class president for a while. Uh, computer club president, I'm sorry. And I was also at a school mascot. Uh, it was a tiger. And his name was Tommy Tiger. But uh, that was fun. And I'm in the models. You know, I can use... I love nunchucks. You know, I've been practicing with them. Uh, a staff, a bow. Uh, I'm really good at firing a rifle. You know, especially if it's got a scope on it. You know, I don't like handguns too much. I like, I prefer rifles. Uh, I love fishing. You know, it's kind of hard to show you right now because I'm inside. You know, we don't exactly have a pond right outside to do. You know, just there. You know, and I can be a smartass. You know, to anybody. You know, I tell you straight up how I feel, and I don't take no crap off nobody. You know, I won't be mean, and, you know, I'll be nice and everything, but I will tell you how I feel. Especially if you piss me off. You know, I will definitely tell, let, let you know. But I won't do it in a bad way. I'll be respectful about it. Um, I love science. You know, it's not my best subject, but I love science and I love physics, you know, and everything about it, you know, and how things work. You know, I'm mechanical, like I said. And, uh, I'm reading the, what we have to say, you know, or the questions, that way I know where I'm at. And it makes it a little easier, you know, than trying to figure out what to say. Mom, you know, me, I have this quirk about everything in its place. You know, I have to have everything where it's supposed to be. And if it's not really neat, at least I know where it is like this okay. like that those are my paperwork right here these right here are my games you know I've got my costume there and I've got 
books and uh, not books, but uh, hats and stuff up here. Um, I've got different things in bags. You know, I had to put it in here because there wasn't no place to put it. I've got computer stuff and I've got other things on there. You know, my disc and everything to go in there. Uh, just whatnot stuff. You know, just different stuff I'm working with. You know, that I'm working on. And I also have, you know, I love time travel, so I've got the DeLorean. And this car right here, I'm still working on getting these. I had four of them, but didn't really work out. And that's called a hot seat, you know. But uh, right now I'm into uh, Defiance, uh, Falling Skies, which is really cool. You know, it's, it makes a good point, you know. It's pretty cool. But Mom... You know, she, she's always known I was in the computers. You know, it drives her nuts sometimes. You know, she's always calling me. But you know, she's the only thing she knows how to do is turn it on. That explains a lot. But uh, she would say I was good at it. And uh, my greatest accomplishments are, you know, accomplishing school and everything. You know, and getting my degree for computers. You know, and I've been doing computers since I was 19. Uh, I have my old lady right now, and I don't mean old lady, I mean old lady, like old lady, you know how it's spelled, O-L dash thing, L-A-D-I-E, old lady, and it sounds like old lady, so that's why I like it, and that's how I refer to her, and she knows, and she she's okay with it. Uh, my hero... I actually have two. One is Spider-Man. That's my hero. You know, one of these days I'll get rid of this keg and get a, you know, get rid of the keg and put the six pack in there. You know, get it one day. But uh, also Captain America because you know, he stands for the USA. You know, I'm really big into America like this right here. You know, see. I'm really in. I love American flags. I love Pegasus. You know, and uh, I love. My favorite color is pink. I will wear pink. I prefer not to wear pink pants, but if I had to, to prove it, I would. Uh, that's my favorite color. And I had a. a what do you call it? Uh, a robe, night robe, and I gave it to my stepdaughter. Uh, if I can invent one thing, what would it be and why? If I can invent one thing, it would be an invention I have called Beach Car. B E A C H C A R R. And it's a boat, car, and a plane all built together. And I've got it all figured out, and that would be the one thing that I would build. Because Dad said that well, if somebody was going to build it, they would have. You know, it's not exactly necessarily true because some people don't think about stuff like that. And uh, I want to be on King of the Nerds for myself. You know, not for competition, not to, you know, it would be nice to win. You know, but I want to do it for myself to see, you know, exactly how intelligent I am. You know, and how far I can take myself. And I love competition, you know, I love competing against these people, you know, I'd have fun doing it. You know, even if I was on the elimination thing, I'd still have fun doing it. You know, I watched the first one, that, you know, the first season, and they did everything I loved to do. You know, I was like, well, why didn't I do this before? You know, maybe I would have got a chance to be in there, you know. But I want to show you something that I did. This right here is something I thought of right here. And it's a puzzle. And I want to see if somebody can figure it out. And then just before I cut it off, I'll let you know what it is. And we'll see if you figured it out. Okay, now, I wanted to show you some chess real quick, what I can do. I don't have but a few seconds. Well, I have an invention as far as I'm going to put a radio on my moped, and it's going to be right here and right here. But um, one thing is, is that... This right here, Pioneer 10. Pi in near 10. See? And that's what I came up with. 
And that's me. Have a nice day. Later.